Matt, you wanted a strong start. We spoke to you at the start of the game. You wanted a strong start. You got that in spades tonight. How's this crowd? That's it's loud, unreal it? playing here with this light show. Yeah, we, we wanted a strong start. We wanted to hit in, making a bit of a scrap around the ball. And as that Jew kicked in after half time, I thought we sort of worked them over a bit and got away on the scoreboard. We talk about that third quarter. I mean, talk about the midfield battle. You dominated in that third quarter. Really, you probably had the game probably in the hand anyway, but you really just took it away from in that third quarter. Yeah, we're in a luxurious position having Aaron getting such dominant first use of the ball. And, Lockie Neal, David Money, Stephen Neal starting to play some good footy and we got some uh, first round draft picks who are really standing up for us, so a reasonable day out. I wanted to talk about Sandlins, I mean have you ever seen a guy who just dictated a game the way that he did today? Yeah, I played with him for You've nine years now, so I'm, I'm pretty lucky to have him, but I thought his presence in the air, as well as around the ground, was yeah. dominant. Well, how big is next week going to be? You've got the derby, you've won three in a row here now, this is going to be a huge game next week. Yeah, it's huge, it's sort of turning into a bit of a fortress for us, but... Uh, West Coast are in ripping form. We're going to have to do the homework on them, and we're hopeful that we'll get 60,000 fans here to watch the first derby at Optus. Right, 43 possessions for you tonight, mate. Well done, brother.